Greetings and welcome to my YouTube channel, TechEAB, the ultimate destination to learn about cloud computing and cybersecurity. In this video, we will discuss a cybersecurity framework called Stride. Stride is a threat modeling framework that was developed by Microsoft in the early 2000s. The framework is used to identify and categorize potential threats to a system or application, in order to help developers and security professionals design more secure systems. The Stride framework provides a mnemonic for six different threat categories, which are First, spoofing. This threat category refers to situations where an attacker can masquerade as someone else by using fake credentials or other means of deception. For example, an attacker might be able to impersonate a legitimate user in order to gain access to sensitive information or perform unauthorized actions. Second, tampering. This threat category refers to situations where an attacker can modify or manipulate data or code in a system, without proper authorization. For example, an attacker might be able to modify data in a database or change the behavior of an application in ways that were not intended. Third, repudiation. This threat category refers to situations where an attacker can deny or repudiate actions or transactions that they have taken in a system. For example, an attacker might be able to claim that they did not perform a certain action, or that an action was performed by someone else. Fourth, information disclosure. This threat category refers to situations where an attacker can gain access to sensitive or confidential information that they should not have access to. For example, an attacker might be able to view passwords or other confidential data, or access customer data that should be protected. Fifth, denial of service. This threat category refers to situations where an attacker can prevent legitimate users from accessing a system or application, by overwhelming the system with excessive traffic or other means of disruption. For example, an attacker might be able to flood a server with traffic or perform other actions that cause the system to crash or become unusable. Sixth, elevation of privilege. This threat category refers to situations where an attacker can gain higher levels of access or privilege in a system or application than they are authorized to have. For example, an attacker might be able to gain administrative access to a system or application, which would allow them to perform actions that they should not be able to. By using the Stride framework, developers and security professionals can better understand the potential threats to a system or application, and take appropriate measures to mitigate those threats. This might include implementing access controls, encrypting sensitive data, monitoring for unusual activity, and performing regular security audits. Overall, Stride is a valuable tool for anyone involved in designing or securing software systems, as it can help to identify potential vulnerabilities and reduce the risk of a security breach. Thanks for watching. Please hit like and subscribe if you like the content.